going on? My name is Matt. I play guitar and attack the mind. Six string slapper. Um, yeah, just like to shred it up. I don't know what else to say. What's up? My name is Baker. I'm vocals for Attack the Mind. What's going on? I'm Brandon. I play drums for Attack the Mind. Hey, what's up? I play four string bass. <laughs> Attack the Mind's been together for about 12 years now. Um, we started in a venue, kind of like Vino's here in downtown Little Rock, and uh, I guess I guess we're ending it here for now, anyway. What's next for me, man? I don't know. I think I'm gonna take a break and just kind of focus on life at the moment. And um, we'll have some other projects going. I'm not gonna stop music, but um, just kind of focusing on personal life at the moment. And then we'll uh, pick it up from there. You'll eventually, you'll eventually hear from us. And my plans are, uh, I'm gonna go home and probably bone my wife. In the times to come, I'm going to start focusing on building my own business and I'm probably going to start, or I have already started writing lyrics and a little bit of music. I want to try to take that somewhere and I'm not opposed to getting into any new projects, but I'm not opposed to starting my own, so I don't want this to be the end of any music that I play. And my favorite memory from Attack the Mind is when us as a lineup, like these guys, like uh, we all had naked practice one time, like it was it was really super hot and the air conditioner wasn't working good, so it was basically underwear or less at the practice. So uh, if you missed that, you missed out because that that was that was a good time. You guys still having a good time tonight? Woo! I want to thank you guys really. It means a lot for everybody to come out tonight. On a serious note, I know there is a lot of shows going on, like around town right now. Some shows in Pontiac, some shows in New York, and Cobar is right down the street, so I'd personally like to thank everybody that came to this instead. Like Got to play for some naked strippers. That's probably that's badass. Never done that before. Well, you know, a uh, new experience. Uh, there's another time. Uh, let's see, what was in uh, Shreveport? The first time I played, um, I got fucking trash, man. And um, I think it was like two in the morning, and I, 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 I could, I don't know what the fuck happened, but I like squeezed my way out of the back door. I was freaking out because no one would let me out, and I was stuck in between the trailer and the door, and I eventually just fucking slid out and just fucking hurled everywhere. All you could hear was like a dying goat. I sound like Bleh. it was just fucking horrible, and uh, I couldn't get back in. I was trashed. It was fun, and um, a lot of memories like that. But you know, that's a pretty vivid one for me. Um, it's just fun times all around, you know. Uh, every every you know show with these guys is a good memory. Everything. It's, these last two years have been awesome. So that's all I could say. Say telling Brandon not to use the bathroom when it was broken in the RV. That, that was, I can just never forget that. <laughs> Our greatest accomplishment as Attack the Mind as a band with this current lineup was probably the release of our latest album, Masterpieces. 
2016. That was a, a, a very well received album for us, and it, it worked over good. And we've been touring all summer, basically pushing that album. And uh, that, that, you know, it, it felt really good to put out the, the, the full, real deal, you know. And, and it, it went over well. We've, we've sold a lot of downloads and stuff, so we're, we're really proud of that for going out of 2016, like put, putting out the masterpieces, the, the album. Going into the studio was definitely a fun experience. Darian from Blue Chair was awesome. You know, he helped me get a better sound for what needed to go in there. It's just, it's just super fun, you know. And that's got to be, you know, probably the biggest accomplishment for me as well is going in there and laying down some tracks. And you know, I was, I when I first joined this band, there was another guitar player, and he drops a week or two after I joined, and I had. I felt like I had a huge responsibility of picking up these songs and um, eventually made it happen, you know? And um, I feel like everything's been worked out pretty well. So uh, that's, you know, all of it's an accomplishment. So that's all I got to say. Thank you guys. I'd like to shout out to all the fans that stuck with us over the years. It's been a long time. Uh, like I said, it, it, it might not be goodbye forever, but it's definitely goodbye for now with this current lineup. And it's, it's, it's going to be a while, but look out, man. You, you, you might see one of us around in, in something else or, or, or me in something else or him in something else or him in something else. And so make, make sure you keep up with us, man, because we, we, we thank all of you guys and we love every single person that ever bought a download, ever bought an album, ever came to a show. Yeah, it means a lot to us. And we're definitely not going to forget it. We're going to take it with us as we move on in our own lives. Very appreciative of it all. We yeah. love you, Josh. You're not here, but you're here in spirit. We, we Actually, love you, I Josh. Thank you. Soon, yeah. yeah. Is there I'm anything we can do? Attack the mind. Uh, I was kind of gay. <laughs> One. Jesus Christ. Like One, two, three. I'm searching for my.